Hey there, it's Kit, and today's topic is the rail fence cipher. A rail fence cipher is a form of transposition cipher. To use the rail fence, you and your co-conspirator must agree on a key beforehand. In this case, a number more than two, but less than the length of the message. The message is written in a zigzag fashion using as many lines as the key requires. The letters are then rewritten in the order that they now appear. For practice, let's send Foxy up in the studio a message. See if he has a answer for that. Huh. To decrypt a message, one simply performs the process in reverse. Start filling in the message, leaving space for the remaining letters. Of course he did. Fair enough. The problem with the fence rail is its simplicity. For example, let's look at Foxy's message again. Even if I didn't know the key, I could try all of the possibilities easily by hand. Foxy's message is 13 characters long, meaning that once I guess that he's using the rail fence, I know that the key is between 3 and 12. 10 possibilities. Furthermore, some of the higher numbers would leave most of the text unscrambled, so in this example, the key can be assumed to be between 3 and 6, leaving 4 possibilities. Easily solvable by hand. And that is pretty much it. Alright, boys and miss, try and decrypt this one. I'll give fair warning, I used a little bit of trickery, but you should be used to that by now. As for the rest of you, fare thee well, my foxy friends.